What's up everyone? Good morning. Welcome to today's video. Just made it for the group ride. Gonna be hanging out with some friends today. We are loving the time down in Krabi. It is great to be here in the clean air. And remember, I do live in Chiang Mai, but during this time, the weather is kind of tough to handle. The smoke, uh, especially for cycling, but even it's just hard for me to not be able to even go outside. So we are loving it down here. And it's gonna rain in the afternoon. It's been raining every day. I'm gonna find a tasty cafe, maybe meet some new friends. And as usual, happy to share this day with you. Hope you are doing well. See you soon. Hello again. So the video today is going to be in two parts. Actually, I'm going to tell you a little story of this bicycle, how it came to be mine and how it came to fit me <laughs> with a bike fit. I'm going to tell you what a bike fit is, kind of what it entails. Team Nietzsche, thank you for supporting me in so many ways, including with this beautiful bicycle. I'm having so much fun on it. I'm so excited to take this thing out. And that's another part kind of a, a secondary part of this trip to Southern Thailand. There's gonna be some racing at the end of it, and I can't wait, but I gotta get in shape first. So in that second part, I'm gonna tell you kind of how I plan to try and get into shape. Hope you enjoy. We're here. Okay, we are here. Huge thank you right now to Pimeng for inviting us to do this. I've never done a bike fit, so I'm very excited, very excited to share all these details, my own learning experience with you. Let's get inside. Oh wait, we actually need the bike for this because the bike fit is completely personal. And it's so cool, the technology that is gonna handle this for us today. The main purpose of all this is comfort and just having fun, feeling good when you're out on the bike. So that's why the main reason to get a bike fit is just to ride totally comfortably. So checking all the angles, like exactly the angles and it's using computer software and this machine over here you see next to the computer and now reviewing all the adjustments and fine-tuning to exactly the most comfortable position for him. So it is not just an easy spin, he's been here for a while and he's working so this needs to see when you're really putting down some power and when you're just riding easy, all the different positions that you're going to be using when there's stress and when it's just easy riding. So you see, keep sweating. <laughs> Thank you, Rita. Okay, so starting from the beginning of the body, measure your foot, measure more than just the length of your foot though. We're even gonna measure the shape of the foot, which is so important getting a bike shoe that fits correctly. Wow. What? Hey. Oh, wow. Okay, so you can see four general types of foot and mine is basically exactly the high arch. You saw a separation here. Yeah, and this is so important getting the shoe to fit properly. So, these are the exact measurements that I have for my bicycle. He took them at four different points using lasers, and this is just for my own use. In the future, other bikes, I can use it easily, and that is why a bike fit is a great investment, actually, because you can use these measurements for other bikes. It doesn't just matter for this one. So, I love this bike right now, but in the future, of course, I'll have more bicycles. In the future, I'll have more bicycles. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go. It's done today. And again, huge thank you to Pime. He is just running around doing so much stuff for us right now, getting everything set up. So, hope you are enjoying this video. So, 
พี่แม่นะครับไม่ใช่เฉพาะของโปรแอปปาโปรเจ้าหน้าที่ใช่ครับผมใครควรจะทำบิ๊กฟิตติ้งใครก็ก็ได้สําหรับคนที่ซีเรียสเรื่องการปาดหรือเพื่อสุขภาพหรืออยากจะเริ่มแบบที่ถูกต้องเราไม่ต้องบาดเจ็บเราก็ควรทำการเริ่มต้นที่ถูกมันต้องทำสิ่งที่ดีในชีวิตรู้สึกยังไง He also went to the special clinic to learn how to do all of this stuff, and it includes so much more than just the bike. There are body measurements he's going to take. He's going to stretch limits of flexibility, is what it is. And checking the flexibility of the IT band. So another discrepancy I didn't know, and it's going to be very useful. Again, measuring things on the bike. My left leg is significantly longer than my right, almost half a centimeter. I think I remember reading that that is normal, but I never knew it about myself. Okay, okay. So, checking the distance of my sit bones. So inside, it doesn't really matter if you're a big or small person. Sit bones can be any different width and shape. And yet, one more thing that you may never have known: I definitely did not know the shape of my sit bones. If you want to see right there, <laughs> I don't know if that's a personal bit of info, but very interesting. <laughs> ตัวนั้นนะโอ้ยอ๋อจ้ะจ้าดูตรงนี้ไม่เจ๋งเนาะโอเคของข้างนี้ครับข้างนี้ที่ยากกว่าข้างนั้นไหมเอาลูกไป
Yeah, it's so crazy. The thing that amazed me the most though, and the thing that turned out to be the only real problem affecting my pedaling, you see on the very bottom along the bottom of the shoe, there are like 10 data points along the bottom of each shoe. And this machine just shows incredible precision. And I was just having a lot of fun even being there. Yeah, we adjusted my shoe and then a little saddle adjustment and that was it. Oh, just so cool. And again, thank you, P Meng, for sharing your experience. Thank you so much for doing this for me. Thank you for the opportunity. And my riding is so much more comfortable because of it. Thank you, man. Good morning, everyone. How's it going? We have we have arrived at the spot for today. We are assuming that it's going to be raining, and so in the afternoon, hopefully, going to find something tasty to share with you while we sit inside and just relax. This all of us live in the north in Chiang Mai. It is so smoky during these days. It's just so uncomfortable to be up there, and honestly, just bad for the health. So we are down in the south and having a great time hanging out together. And the mental aspect, it's just great to take a break. The peace, the feelings of relaxation are just palpable each day. Just the, the stress of the past year. And so thank you for allowing me to do these vlogs. They are much more easy to edit. I can still hopefully share with you my excitement for what happens each day when I'm in these new areas. Something I'm so excited for. So thank you for hanging out with me. I'm going to find some cool stuff to share with you today. And it's starting with coffee. You better believe it. Let's go see. 